gives us a national switch. Uh, a fully inclusive state payment system means that we've made provisions for a payment system that nobody is left behind. We're talking about, if you want to look at gender, male, female, you want to look at professionals, the formal and the informal sector. Uh, if you want to look at the technology divide as well, because um, you can never tell who you will transact with. So a fully inclusive payment system for Gibbs is to ensure that we have a payment systems platform, uh, products and services that we cater for every type, personal, corporate, uh, retail, whatever you can think of. That's what that means for Gibbs. that uh, for a country like Ghana where our, our infrastructure is not matured, you don't want to be shortchanged by an inefficient payment system. I'm talking about a case where I live in Accra, I've been paid and I happen to be in the northern part of Ghana tomorrow and I'm not able to transact. So we need to ensure that we have mitigated against some of these um, challenges that we have in the country. So if I have to transact with transact with somebody in the northern sector or the eastern sector and they do not belong to my bank, I should be able to still uh, participate and, and uh, perform my, my transactions in terms of sending, receiving, payment, etc. And that should be nationwide.